Let's work with the equation of a quadratic function. For example, let's find the equation of the quadratic function whose graph passes through the point negative 2, negative 1, and has vertex at negative 1, negative 3. And then we'll put our answer in standard form. Now we have the following vertex form for the equation of a quadratic function. f of x is equal to a times x minus h quantity squared plus k, where hk is the vertex. So here we're given that the vertex is at negative 1, negative 3, which means h is equal to negative 1, and k is equal to negative 3 which we can plug into this vertex form here, which gives us that f of x is equal to a times x minus a minus 1 quantity squared plus negative 3, or f of x is equal to a times x plus 1 squared minus 3. Now it still remains to find a here. But we can use the fact that this point up here, negative 2, negative 1, lies on our graph in order to help us find A. Because if negative 2, negative 1 lies on the graph, that means that F of negative 2 is equal to negative 1. So we can plug in X equal to negative 2 and F of X equal to negative 1 in our equation here, and we'll be able to find a. Namely, negative 1 is equal to a times negative 2 plus 1 quantity squared minus 3, or negative 1 is equal to a times negative 1 squared minus 3, which means that negative 1 is equal to a minus 3, or a is equal to 2. And so plugging this value of a into our equation here gives us that f of x is equal to 2 times x plus 1 quantity squared minus 3. Now this is our equation. However, looking back up here, we're asked to write our answer in standard form, which we can do by squaring this out. Namely, f of x is equal to 2 times x squared plus 2x plus 1, and then minus 3. And now distributing the 2, we get f of x is equal to 2x squared plus 4x plus 2 minus 3, or f of x is equal to 2x squared plus 4x minus 1, which is the equation we're looking for in standard form. And this is how we find the equation of a quadratic function given information about its graph. Thank you, and we'll see you next time.